Okay, summer is rapidly approaching. Well, maybe not summer, but spring is pretty close and with spring comes the promise of being able to do some outdoor activities. And one thing that I used to have was a nice slim wallet that was good for any kind of athletic endeavors such as bike riding and hiking and such without any or at least without a lot of excess bulk and so uh, since that other old wallet is long gone I decided to purchase a new one and this was a spur-of-the-moment purchase uh, when I was at a local Pep Boys and came across this wallet very slim very light uh, with a Ford Mustang motif on there and being a Ford Mustang guy um, I decided to go with this one so let me just quickly open this up and this is made from buckle down and you can't actually buy it directly from buckle buckle down um, they have a uh, list of uh, suppliers and the one where you can actually get it online would be uh, beltsdirect.com uh, strangely enough they don't have this one shown on their uh, website they do have some other Ford products and some other ones, um, but just not the Mustang one. So let's just quickly open this up and you can see what it looks like on the inside. All right, and this is the UPC code here. Leather wallet, Ford Mustang, WFM009. So you can use this information to try to track it down if you wish, if you're interested in getting one like this, which is a Ford Mustang motif. This is a leather wallet, but it does have uh, a synthetic interior. And it comes with this interesting little card. I'm not sure exactly what the purpose of this is, perhaps just to demonstrate or hold uh, maybe the hold the shape or just to demonstrate as you're in the store uh, what it would look like with a, uh, a card in there All right. and I guess you can I forget what these things are called now and you can uh, probably use your camera to find out more information about this if you had this particular um, image to scan but I have a couple of my own cards to put in there and wh when I um, had my old wallet what I would basically just have in there would be my identification which they have a nice slot provided there so you can just slide your ID card right down in there and the whole purpose is to try not to have too much bulk uh, because as I said this is something that I intend to use specifically for outdoor activities so I'm not going to be carrying a lot of stuff with me in my wallet so I would just have an ID card maybe uh, a credit card and these are just stand-ins these aren't the real thing as you can tell and I would probably have my concealed carry license in there as well dollar dollar bill y'all so you throw in a couple bucks and this is literally a couple bucks so you just throw that right on in there fold it and here you are with a nice small profiled wallet very light with your essential information in there as I said you would have maybe your ID card driver's license whatever in there just a credit card you know just in case you need it um, and if you're going to be doing some outdoor activities and carrying a uh, firearm with you you might want to have your concealed carry in a pouch like this or in this particular location or here I mean be honest with you you could probably even get away with using your concealed carry as your ID um, and just have the two things you just have your concealed carry license 
and uh, a credit card and some dollars if you want to go for maximum lightness and thinness and then when you finish your activity go back home you can just easily transfer these two or three items back to your normal wallet and you'll be good to go now in terms of construction on this thing um, that's yet to be seen you can see there that it is single stitched around the perimeter and around all the uh, the openings and that single stitch holds the liners in as well so we'll just have to see over time what the durability is like it probably won't be get a lot of rough usage as I said it's going to be mostly for outdoor activities just in my pocket as I'm biking walking jogging or whatever the case might be but um, yeah I just thought I would uh, share this with you and uh, if any of you guys have used any of these products before or this product before from uh, buckle down um, you just let me know how you made out and I will do the same as this thing ages alright thanks for watching bye bye